Hey everybody, it's me, Daniel Ortiz here at uh, SAGU at the Garrison Wellness Center. Uh, going over a little bit about diet changes today. So, uh, the things that we're gonna, I'm going to ask you to do or you're going to want to do is or you don't need to make big changes all at once. So what you're going to want to do is, is um, like I said, before, it's like if you're eating out four or five times a week, cut it down to two or three times a week. If you're uh, having those uh, soft drinks two or three times a day, cut it down to... Uh, once a day so get the idea we're not making a big drastic changes something that's going to cause you to uh, to fail all we're doing is making um, small dietary changes in your um, in your daily routine weekly routine uh, also what you're going to want to try to do if you can if at all possible is trying into the habit of um, going for a little walk after you get done eating so and um, so and also in the evenings so if you're at home and you're bored and you're watching TV or watching any kind of show, um, if you're going to snack, don't snack on a pizza. Don't snack on a hamburger. Don't, <laughs> don't snack on stuff like that. Uh, get you a salad, I know, right? Doesn't sound too good. But uh, yeah, get you a, a salad, chicken salad. Uh, small changes like that, you're not going to want to... Um, not eat you don't have to go into a fasting uh fasting thing not yet um you know there's a such a thing as a called fasted cardio where you don't eat for like eight to twelve hours in the evening and then do cardio first thing in the morning on an empty stomach it causes your body to utilize body fat that's later on down the road once you get down into uh once you get into working out and uh changing your adjusting your diet a little bit also um i know you've been doing your uh I know you've been doing your walking. I know you've been doing your uh, jumping jacks, your push-ups, your core work, your uh, mountain climbers, other things, ex exercises that I showed you to do last week, the week before last. Um, just a little bit, like I said, you don't have to do a lot. We're just doing a little bit. We're making small changes. Again, do not want you so sore that you cannot move. Again, um, if you haven't been working out in a long time, uh, we're not going from sitting on the couch to trying to run a marathon. Like I said that before, we're not trying to do that. Also, what we're going to try to do is do uh, um, just make, just like I said, just make slow changes. Right. So again, if you're uh, if you've been doing a little bit of training that I've showed you, that I've showed you, that I've recommended to you the last couple of weeks, then you might be able to do the jump ropes. You might be able to do a few of the exercises that I'm showing. And if you can't, then don't worry about it. Um, you can make modifications on the jump rope. You can do pretend jump ropes. Think like you're doing jump Doing this, right? Doing this, um, right? And then uh, if you can't do the push-ups like I showed you. They make modifications. You don't want to do the uh, shadow boxing. You can do this, right? Shadow boxing here, here, right? And then the uh, and then the fake jump ropes. Now, if you're, if you're good doing it, if you're in good shape, and it's not bothering you at all right now, right? And you want to step it up a notch, saying, I think it might work out too easy. Then we'll do, uh, we'll do this right here. So we're going to do, do the jump on the chair like this. Right? And we're going to switch it up here. Here, switch it up. Here. Even here, switch it up more here. If you want to make it harder, right? It's here. Then. That's it. That's how you change it up. <laughs> but you slowly progress. And most of you beginners are not going to be able to do that. Um, but that's a goal to get to. Uh, I'm a 52, almost 53 year old man, so if I can do that, there's no reason I'm not going to do this. Uh, but if we go in small steps, so we're going to slowly get each other. Uh, but, slow, but the thing that I want you to focus on, you doing 